The pre-mixed coffee that caused at least five people to become ill after consuming it will not be taken off the shelves as there is no evidence to suggest contamination at the main production line. Health Minister Datusri Dr S. Supramaniam said, apart from the samples of the tempered coffee sachets, which police say contain substances believed to be drugs, there was no evidence at the moment to put the blame on the producers of the coffee product. There's no evidence to suggest that the main product line has been contaminated. So, till uh, we finalise the investigation, we, we would advise people to be careful, but we don't have any immediate intention of drawing it from the shelf until we have strong evidence to incriminate the producers in this. He said that the ministry had paid a visit to the factory and found no evidence of drugs after conducting tests on their products. On Saturday, Georgetown OCPD Assistant Commissioner Anwar Omar said police found samples of the premixed coffee consumed by the two affected Nepalese security guards contained green substance. Police also found signs of tearing at the bottom of the sachets indicating that they were open and resealed and weigh 10 grams more than its original weight of 40 grams. Five patients received treatment at Penang Hospital between January 27 and 30 after consuming premixed durian coffee.